Hi everyone, it's Gracie, and I'm here with uh, the last project of um, Marion's 31 Day 31 Video Challenge, and this is my completed Valentine Mini. Um, I had posted a couple of pages that I had started, and I don't remember what day it was, but I finally was able to finish it, and just wanted to show you guys. So, um, on the front cover, um, I think I went over all of this, and I'm sorry if I'm blabbing. Um, but I just used this textured paper, um, did a little pearl flourish here, and I just made this out of string pearls and glued it down. Had uh, two Tim Holtz at edge tickets, um, blinged them up a little bit, um, went over the corners with, I believe this was the black, um, I don't remember the exact color, um, Distressing Ink by Tim Holtz. Uh, this is a flower that I created using the Tim Holtz um, dye. Uh, I think it's called Tattered Florals. And uh, this is a little um, brad that I put here in the center to hold it down. Just used um, some miscellaneous pieces of um, ribbon and fibers for the binding. Then on the inside, um, just had this little envelope here that I made and just put some Velcro on there with a little love note on the inside. A little tag, very plain. Um, on, on this page, I uh, used another Ad Dodge ticket. Uh, these little flowers came from, I believe it was Michael's dollar bin. Um, just loved them. They're so cute. Um, added some stickles on this flourish here just to make it pop a little bit. And on this page, just two really simple tags. And let's see, just some photo mounts. Uh, these are Prima flowers with some bling. Um, these are places for small pictures and has a little acetate window on both of them. Uh, these were cut out of the Tim Holtz uh, tattered floral dies. And I just put some buttons on them and put them up on pop dots. Another really simple page, um, used a Prima flower, put a pearl in the center of it, and just layered paper for photo mount and added some lace trim at the bottom. Um, now here's where it starts um, kind of new, where I finished it off. I uh, put a little tag here and added these little charms. I thought they were so cute. They actually started out um, kind of like a brass looking color, and I just added some um, alcohol inks and silver to them and I just thought it turned out really really good. Uh, this is a butterfly that I created um, using the technique um, that I did a tutorial on not too long ago and did his wings a little bit differently. Um, it's a really cool technique and I'll do a tutorial on that. I really liked how it came out. Uh, then on this page, uh, just some coordinating cardstock for this paper line. Just did some simple tags. I um, created this little key on my Cricut and this little heart um, cut out on my Cricut as well. And I did a really kind of the same technique that I did on this butterfly. I did on here and here. And there's so much texture on it. Um, and then I went over it with some distressing ink. And it came out really, really cool. Uh, let's see. Over here, just a plain tag. Added some bling and some fibers. Um, on this, I uh, added some uh, lace and some more bling across it just to make it pop. Uh, this is a, a purchased paper flower. It started out life um, as pink. And I put some of my homemade glimmer mist on it. Turned it red. And then... Um, edged it with some black distressing ink. just thought it needed to look a little tattered. And here, uh, just really simple little photo mount. I cut these out of my Nestabilities. Um, another Ad Dodge ticket, a Prima Flower. Put a little button on it. And then this is the last page. Just really simple tag using my butterflies. Um, put some bling down here at the bottom. This is another Prima flower with a little button. But I know I went through really quick. Um, but that's my finished 
mini and I really really enjoyed it I think these are my two favorite pages <laughs> but thanks for watching guys I really appreciate it and I tell you what these last 31 days have really been a challenge um, I really appreciate Marion um, putting the call out to all of us crafters and getting us um, you know, away from the stores from buying all the stuff and actually sitting down and putting it to good use. I, I really enjoyed uh, doing all the the different crafts and it really encouraged me to um, be really creative and step out of um, the the box and you know I actually got to do two tutorials which I really enjoyed doing that and hopefully um, I'll have time to, to do more and to be as creative as some of these other great 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 people that are on YouTube thanks again everybody and I really appreciate the opportunity to to be part of the group bye